I got interrupted. God damn it. <laughs> okay, quick explanation in one minute or less. I sold some stuff to get the extra intel for the contact albatross mission. Essentially, it's an additional dossier info on Sis, aka that dual wielding handgun chick who nearly killed me, who did kill me several times, and we're on the contact albatross mission right now. Essentially, she came up behind us, pointed her handguns at us, we decided to be calm and rational about it, and then showed some irritation once he showed up, the albatross guy. The reason I'm explaining all this is because I got interrupted unexpectedly, so two minutes worth of video footage, gone. 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 So, let's begin again. <laughs> Here. Oh, we're giving her back the locket. Did she give that to you? I see. The locket is a childhood memento. Perhaps those days are gone. Huh. Regardless, thank you for sparing her life. The gratitude comes from both of us, it seems. Sorry it came to that. I didn't want to fight her, but the situation didn't leave much time for talking. Right. Although she's not much of a talker, I take it. She's a mute. Figure. Let's walk. Sis will make sure we're not interrupted. All right. So, what did you want to talk about? I know to all outward appearances you're a rogue agent. I also know about Alpha Protocol. Really? In your case, it's being used for its intended purpose. No choice. It wasn't my choice, really. One of my associates made the decision for me. I disagree. You had other options, I'm sure. Really? Did enacting Alpha Protocol change your mission? No. Then you should be proud of your accomplishment. What accomplishment? It's not often that one gets to turn the tools of their own government against them. What? For the right reasons. Oh, and right. Alpha Protocol, it is a powerful tool. He knows a lot about Alpha Protocol. Between Halbeck and you, I'm beginning to feel like everyone knows about Alpha Protocol. It may seem that way. I'd argue you're simply traveling in a smaller circle here, on the fringe of international politics. Is that what G-22 is? On the fringe of international politics? No. We have aspirations, as does any government. Oh, but really? we believe that agendas are well, accomplished by careful study and observation. If the status quo is disrupted, it makes predicting triggers and events more difficult. You sound like one of the analysts of Alpha Protocol I know. Alpha Protocol has always <laughs> had someone in that role. It helps them function as intended, no matter what iteration of the program. It's an odd thing. A government-sponsored program whose purpose is to prevent being policed by its own government. Now, what kind of foundation is that for a country? Get to the point. I don't want to debate with you. What do you want? I propose we become allies. What, I become a member of G-22? No. I propose we cooperate. You will find that as That's extensive as Alpha Protocol's leftover safe houses and gadgets are, well, G-22 has access to much more. And the price? Let us say, I owe you. You've already paid me. And the only uh, currency I value. What do you say? Fine. All right. I need all the friends I can get. And for some reason, I trust you. You won't regret it, Mike. I think I'm trying too hard, just again, to be nice to everybody. We're out of time, I'm afraid. Thank you for listening to me, Mike. I know you have a great deal of work ahead of you. Albatross, I need to know something. Yes. What? This business with Halbeck. I can still prevent it, right? There's a way to stop them. This isn't going to end well, is it? Mike. It never does. Ah, uh, Figures. Wow, that was one short mission. <laughs> Didn't even get through half the episode, half the part. Let's see. Contacted by Albatross, cell leader. Agreed to meet him and sis in a local park. Albatross offered Thornton an alliance, largely because Agent Thornton spared sis's life on the yacht. They, I agreed to it, and they parted on good terms. So now new vendor op options open through G22 connections. Hopefully that means that I get access to buying stuff in the clearinghouse at last, because as you guys saw, there was hardly anything in there. The ripoffs.
Not selling me crap. What's wrong with them? <laughs> New email, new store items. Let's check it out. Check the email first. Huh. As long as we're working together, I will share access to our black market channels. When you log into the clearinghouse, you'll access the G22 Supply Network. How lovely of you. Didn't I already read this? Yep, I already read it. <laughs> I'm broke, so what am I going to buy? <laughs> Damn, a fuckload of new pistols. Some assault rifle stuff, too. It's not like I can buy anything, though, so... Oh, wow, check this, check this thing out. Compared to the SWAT utility armor, it gives a whole bunch of bonuses and looks pretty badass. Looking forward to get that uh, getting that stuff on me once I get enough cash. Okay, so let's just rush to the next mission already. I want to get enough to get the Gregorian informant intel that I don't have yet, so let's do the investigate weapon shipment stuff. Acquired information on Dimitri's presence. Disgruntled mercenary left some valuables. Courier placed a sniper rifle in the train yard. And we got Das here on the Veteran Combat Initiative, a mercenary force operating at the mission site. So, looks like we're going to be looking for clues as to the whereabouts of the prototype missiles. Okay. Can't believe that last mission only took me like four minutes. Well, technically six minutes, but you guys didn't see the first two minutes. Sorry. Can't really help that stuff, people. Now I can predict that I'll die like 10 times this or next part. <laughs> oh shit, what's going on? Might help to get armor on people. Uh oh. Yeah, you can learn. Uh-uh-uh. Come out. Oh, shoot through those boxes you're crouching behind. The Russian chick. Wouldn't want that. Ah, America. CIA. I am surprised I did not hear you in Moscow. I'm on vacation. So you come here for the scenery? Or are you here to catch a train, darling? Let's ditch the interrogation. You're here for the missiles, so let's not play games. Darling, I do not play games. Ooh, being aggressive neither do you. Helps. But we should talk. I do not want to shoot you, as I only have so many bullets. Could have <laughs> fooled me. I propose a deal. I am here for the same reason you are, to find this Halbeck train. We work together, we both get what we want. Sounds intriguing, but I need to read the fine print. You stay out of the way of my men. They will not shoot you. Oh, so you're here with someone already? Well, that makes things awkward. <laughs> this station is heavily guarded. We can help each other reach the train. If you cross us, it will only be trouble for you. Hmm. Well, considering you have the drop on me... Fine. Then it sounds like a deal. For now. That is good. Because I think we have company. I think I'm being a nice guy again too much. <laughs> Alright, let's get to the next part.